Margot Robbie, 32, has now played the anti-hero Harley Quinn in three separate films, but one prop manages to connect them all. Harley's notorious weapon of choice, a baseball bat, now sits next to her bed as she told Express. Co.uk. Last month, Margot Robbie became one of the youngest actors honoured through a BAFTA's Life in Pictures event. At the London event, Margot told Express. Co.uk and other outlets some of the behind-the-scenes highlights of her career, from Neighbours to Barbie and beyond. When asked if she had ever taken a prop or piece of memorabilia home with her, Margot didn't require a moment to think. She immediately responded with a chuckle, I have my Harley bat next to my bed in case anyone breaks in. The iconic goodnight bat named after the writing on its side, was first wielded by Margot in 2016's Suicide Squad. She picked up the bat again to lead 2020's Birds of Prey while also producing the film and then finally in James Gunn's reimagining of Suicide Squad in 2021. The celebrated actress admitted she relishes playing Harley Quinn, although noted each time she does, the character sticks around a while longer than any others. Although Margot had never encountered the comic book character before the 2016 film, she has garnered a deep connection with Harley. The actress declared her only hope for the character is she should never change or evolve, as it's simply not in her nature despite that evolution being a general backbone of any Hollywood flick. Despite having a lengthy relationship with Harleen Quinzel, it was recently announced Margot will not be making an appearance in the upcoming Joker film. The new film is reportedly following Joaquin Phoenix's portrayal of the villain and will see pop star Lady Gaga taking on Harley's mantle. Speaking to Entertainment Tonight earlier this month, Margot assured there was no bad blood in the casting decision. Don't miss, instead, the actress shared her extreme excitement the character would now be passed on to another actress, saying Harley has become kind of like Batman or Hamlet, that gets handed from actor to actor. She added, it's all I could have ever hoped for and believes Lady Gaga will do an amazing job. The new film, titled Joker, Folie et il de Deux or Madness for Two in French, is expected to be released in 2024. While Margot was the first to bring a live-action Harley Quinn to the big screen, the character has been an animation icon for decades. Arlene Sorkin was the first to breathe life into the character in Batman, the animated series in 1992 and was followed by voice actress Tara Strong. Jillian Jacobs, Hyden Walsh and The Big Bang Theory alum Kaylee Cuoco and Melissa Rauch have all also had a moment to voice the character in a variety of animated films, series and video games. Alongside the Goodnight Bat, Margot revealed at the BAFTA event that she also still has some of the costumes and her ice skates from 2017's I, Donya. Margot, who is also a producer on this film, portrayed the notorious American figure skater and denied receiving the wardrobe was part of the perks of her double role in the film's production. She went on to explain she had actually bought the skates herself and trained and performed in them, meaning they were already worn in and accustomed to her own feet by the time she took them home, 